okay namaste to all uh, welcome to you all in this virtual class uh, yesterday we have discussed about the group plate mentis nematerial mentis and annelida uh, in this topic we have studied about the characteristic of plate mentis characteristic of nematerial mentis and characteristic of annelida uh, so today we are again going to discuss about uh, remaining three groups of invertebrate they are arthropoda mollusca and echinodermata so i have mentioned these three groups with characteristic on the chart uh, let's look towards our ones first here i have mentioned the characteristic of arthropoda with example here i have mentioned four characteristic of arthropoda in same year i have mentioned four characteristic of mollusca on the chart and another is characteristic of echinodermata with example here right so guys uh, you have to copy the characteristics with example right so uh, you have to copy with clear and i think uh, you can copy the characteristic from chart or uh, i will write here on the board so let's discuss from the characteristic of arthropoda first look here once on the chart and uh, first one is arthropoda arthropoda group first one is arthropoda group means mainly the group arthropoda uh, what includes all the animals or um, all the animals are having two pair of wings or you can write first characteristic of arthropoda is they have two pair of wings two pair of wing, me, wing means tini har ko dui joda pa ko ja bhane ko wings help them to fly easily uh, means in the air right so first one is they have two pair of wings they have two pair of wings this is okay let's once uh, write the characteristic through the example ones let me draw the picture of butterfly here because the butterfly is the example of arthropoda so uh, look here let's look here once i'm making the picture of butterfly here this is butterfly so you can make in this way same drawing try to make the drawing also uh these are the wings wings one it means they have two pair of wings means this is first pair and uh, let me draw the second pair of wings here this is this is second pair of wings this is the picture of butterfly or and it is the example of arthropoda group this is butterfly butterfly the butterfly have two pair of wings one pair and this is two pair they have two pair of wings first one and the second one is they have three pair of jointed legs they have they have three pair of jointed legs jointed legs all of the group arthropoda have three pair of jointed legs it means they have six legs in their body so they are jointed not means what uh, in same they have jointed leg means this one suppose this is joint this is joint like this their legs are like this means they have jointed legs second one and third one is they are they are found in water land and in air and in 
the animal of the group arthropoda can found in water land and in अब यो आर्थोपोडा ग्रुप का एनिमल हो हामी वाटरमा पनि पाउन सक्छौ जस्तो वाटरमा के पाउन सक्छौ सपोज यु क्यान राइड हियर सपोज स्कर्फिन्स ऑन द लैंड यु क्यान राइड सपोज कब्रोस दिस इज एन्ड इन द एयर यु क्यान फाइंड बटरफ्लाई सो वी क्यान फाउंड द एनिमल्स अफ द ग्रुप आर्थोपोडा इन वाटर लैंड एन्ड इन एयर दिस इज अंडरस्टैंड गाइस दिस इज ओके एन्ड द वन इज दे हैव पेयर अफ एंटिनास they have they have pair of pair of antenna antenna they have pair of antenna means the antenna is present on the animals head suppose these two are the antenna the butterfly one and two that means it is a one pair they are present on the head of what the animals and they are they are what x as means these antennas x as a sense organ of what the animals of the group arthropoda jaso cockroach ko pani tau ko ma dui ta antenna huncha ani ya butterfly ko pani huncha ani you can say grass bird ko pani antenna huncha these antennas x as a sense organ in the animal of group arthropoda this is or in example you can write बटरफ्लाई एक्जापल में यू कैन राइट इक्जापल बटरफ्लाई डन और एनदर यू कैन राइट कग्रोज कग्रोज दिस इज इक्जापल कग्रोज एंड एनदर यू कैन राइट ग्रास ओपर ग्रास ओपर दिज आर दल अफ ग्रुफ वट द आर्थ ओपर सो दिस इज all about the group arthropoda so try to copy this characteristics with example and uh, you have to make the drawing of you can write your choice if you want to draw the picture of butterfly you can make or if you want to draw the picture of grass or you can make this is all about the group arthropoda right okay have you copied guys very good okay next one then another uh, mollusca let's discuss about the mollusca from the same characteristics and generally the group mollusca the animal of the group mollusca have soft body covered with the hard shell bhaneko mollusca group ka animal haru ko body kasto huncha bhane soft huncha and the soft body ka huncha bhane tinko hard shell ko bhitra raheko huncha means soft body remains inside the hard shell let's discuss the characteristic of mollusca मोलस्का द फर्स्ट क्यारेक्टरिस्टिक इज दे हैव सफ्ट बॉडी दे हैव सफ्ट बॉडी बॉडी कवर्ड विथ हार्ड शेल कवर्ड विथ हार्ड शेल तीन को बॉडी सफ्ट हो तर क्या होता हार्ड सिल कवर कर लेट मी ड्र द पिक्चर अफ द एनिमल अफ द ग्रुप मलस का इयर आई एम ड्रो गोइंग टू ड्र द पिक्चर अफ हेलेक्स इयर सपोज दिस इज हेलेक्स दिस इज इज द पिक्चर अफ हेलेक्स दिस इज हेलेक्स हेलेक्स पिक्चर हो हेलेक्स ग्रुप मोलस्का को एनिमल को इक्जापल हो द सफ्ट बॉडी अफ दिज एनिमल्स रिमेन्स इन साइड द हार्ड सेल मीन्स दिस इज हार्ड सेल यो हार्ड सेल हो यो हार्ड सेल को भित्र के होता उसको सफ्ट बॉडी रखे होता है हार्ड सेल ने हेल्प कर प्रोटेक्शन को हेल्प कर सपोज उसको सेंस हो गया हमें एंटीना टच करने हो हेडलाई कह लुका उसको हार्ड सेल को भित्र लुका क्योंकि इट गिव्स द प्रोटेक्शन it gives protection to the hedex so it hides it means is what head inside the hard shell this is and second characteristic is they have tentacles on head they have tentacles tentacles on head 
उसको हेड में टेंटाकल्स आ रहे हैं इसलिए क्या करते हैं डी टेंटाकल्स हेल्प देम टू डिटेक्ट टू फाइंड आउट डी ऑब्जेक्ट ऑब्जेक्ट कौन सा होगा अगर उसको तो टेंटाकल्स आ रहे हैं लाइक ऑब्जेक्ट आ रहे हैं डिटेक्ट they are unisexual animals. Means the animal of the group mollusca are unisexual. Unisexual means the animals having only one sexual organ in their body, right? They have only one sexual organ means either they have male or either they have female sexual organ in their body. When you go unisexual, when you go animal test, any one of just go body man, you would have a sexual organ. Present the so, male sex organ, the female sex organ. So the animal of the group mollusca are unisexual animal. They are unisexual animal. They are unisexual animals. This is. And third one. Okay, third one done. Fourth one is they are found on water and also in water. Means the animal of the group mollusca can found in in water and on the land. Both land or something duty thang. Means land or water, I mean duty thang. Upon the shock, some mollusca group group ka animal. They can found. They can found in water and on land. Do we thang upon the shock, sir? Okay. Mollusca group ka animal and the example of the Mollusca group look here once and try to copy with the example also because in examination uh, means it can be asked suppose write the example of arthropoda right or arth example of Mollusca so it is necessary to write the examples also and the next right example one is butterfly uh, bu butterfly no, sorry one is Alex Another limex, these are is extra. Alex and limex are the example of group mollusca. This is all about the group mollusca. And uh, our last one, or the last group of invertebrate, and today's our means last content is the characteristic of echinodermata. Characteristic of echinodermata. Let's discuss about the characteristics of Echinodermata from the characteristic. Okay. Last one echinodermata, last group is C H I N O D E R M A T A. Echinodermata. Echinodermata group. Last one. Let's discuss the characteristic. Uh, first one is their body is covered with hard material means the animal of the group echinodermata their body is covered with the hard material means the hard material remains just above the body of the animal of this group suppose let me draw a picture of the group uh, means echinodermata here uh, making the picture of starfish here starfish the starfish same looks like what the star this is starfish so their soft body remains inside the hard shell means the hard shell protects them from the harmfulness this is this is the picture of what the group or oh, this is the picture of starfish and it is the example of group you can know that this is starfish this is so first one characteristic is their body is covered with hard shell. Their, their body is covered with, with hard material. Hard material. Unko body hard material like you cover the The hard material protects them from harmful. This is first one. And second one is their mouth is located. Their mouth is located in the lower side. Located in the lower side. C 
side of its body. The mouth of the means mouth is located in the lower side of its body means the mouth of the starfish or the mouth of the animals of the group Echinodermata what remains inside their sea means what body body ko bithra huncha unko mouth jasto yo mati ko sakhe sho bhane yani ra hadashi le cover gari huncha ra esko bithra tira unko ke huncha mouth hi huncha present huncha bhane ko dishi and third one characteristic you can write they move with the help of what tube feet means they have tube feet present in their body so these are the tube feet so they move with the help of their tube feet or in short you can write they have tube foot feet they move with the help of the help of tube feet tube tube f e t feet dishes they move with the help of tube feet and the last one is the last characteristic of the group echinodermata is they are found in sea they are found in she it means the animal of the group echinodermata we can found in the sea found in the sea means a large mass of water uh, so in the large mass of water we can easily find find the what the animals of the group echinodermata so for example starfish or in you can write another is sea cucumber also example man example of group echinodermata are starfish starfish and another is sea cucumber sea cucumber these two are the main example of the group echinodermata okay have you got it guys okay very good okay let's you have to try to learn all the characteristics right or try to write the characteristic of these three groups of um, yourself at home uh, and you can match the characteristic uh, which are means the word written by you with these characteristics or if you have any confusion or, or if if you have any difficulties in writing or in solving the questions related to this topic you can ask me or you can ask to your teacher right so uh, let's write the homework for today once for homework and uh, let's form up ones the today's homework is homework in short write write the characteristics characteristics of the group group arthropoda arthropoda and uh, mollusca mollusca with two example two two example two two examples right this is homework in homework you have to write the characteristic of group arthropoda and mollusca in good and writing okay guys our first lesson has finished today right so we will continue our next lesson on next month's or next part so if you have any confusion related to this topic you can contact me or you can ask to your teacher try to solve all the questions from exercise right so uh, with clear and writing or in the exercise there is drawing is given there so you have to draw the pictures of what uh, the different animals in the chart and you can present this chart on your classes class right okay thank you this much for today we will continue our next lesson on next day thank you thank you very much